good. It's your boy Buck Wild, Hooligan Squad. You already know. When it comes to music, who's the J Squad and what do you know about them? To me, J Squad was the people who put crump beats in the game. Because to me, I was one of the people that was dancing to G Unit, Dipset, all type of rap music. Todd Eyes and them brought J Squad and like changed up the whole game of crump. So without J Squad, there would not be no other crump beat makers. J Squad really opened the door for everyone else to make beats, basically. Was it? What was the first ever all crump event? What the all crump event? Not a cage. Who in Lancaster? Crump Arena. Now, with that being said, I know you've been there. I've seen you. Definitely been a lot. Crump Arena was where it was at. Crump Arena is a dope. Lancaster, if you was a part of Lancaster, going to crump out there, you know what it was. Shout out to the beach, niggas. Squad, squad ah, beach here, you know. Beat ups, you already know, little Beat bucks. Up. You already know, HS, all that. It's the squad, it's the squad, it's the squad. We out here. But yeah, though, that's how it really went, though. Lancaster had the torch out of time. Like, when everything was really going on in crump, Lancaster was the center of attention. It just, it just moved to other areas right now. So it's like kind of... Out of town really got crump moving. Out of town it was keeping the West Coast people on their toes right now because they're going hard. What is your take on crump right now when it comes to unity in the West? Um, it's, it's trying to get back together. Everyone's trying to get back cool and stuff, but it's not the same as it used to be. I, it's like it's love, but the love is not. You're not sure if it's real or not just because so much stuff happened in the past. But they trying to get it back together like it used to be, though, more or less. Now, when it comes to Crump as of now, there's the old Crump and there's also the new Crump. I'm talking about people in general and the Crump game. Now, what are some of the, the differences and I want to say disadvantages of both sides? Um... The advantages they have now, they were able to study us, the, 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 everyone that came before them. So they know the, a lot of the do's and don'ts. So uh, like I, I like the new generation now, though, because you see a lot of new creativity. Some of people, some people do it, but there's a lot of people that copy styles. But the people that do some outrageous, out-the-box stuff, ah, hats off to y'all. Y'all niggas is hella dope. But the new generation is hella dope to me. I like the new generation. It's not better than the old, though, but I like the new generation, the creativity. Now, would you say there's a, a problem between the two, though? With some. Some of the old people don't know how to pass the torch, and some of the, young, some of the new people don't know how to be respectable to some of the older cats. So the clash is real right now, though, but it needs to be respect in the middle for everyone to understand and to grow. That's all it is, basically. But what's your perspective and take on some of the females in Crump? The females in Crump are dope to me. It's a, it's a lot of them. The only thing is, it's like before it was a lot of girls back in the days that had their own names. Now a lot of the girls are under a lot of the other dancers that's tight, though. There's no shades and none of that because they're dope. She's dope. Girl Rass. There's a lot of just girls up right now that's coming up that's just dope. But it's just, it's just a lot of girls that's just like Prissy, Prissy build herself never had a big homie none of that and just doing her it's not a lot of girls that not to say they're getting helped by their big homie but a lot of people's getting the attention because they have a big homie not saying they're getting help like i said but that's how it works hs but do, would you say it's time for some of the newer crump dancers to start fans back up again um yeah because it just squat it just gives an opportunity and like you, it's, it's, it's better to, to set more seeds. You set more seeds, more stuff plants, and that gives opportunity for more people, and then the movement grows, and it, it will never die. If you keep it sheltered, it's just gonna die, and people are gonna start having beef. After a while, you're gonna outgrow the movement, and it's gonna be, who else is, gonna, who else is there to do what we're doing? So we need the new generation to step up and become big homies and do their thing. Shout out to Squad, you already know, HS, Hooligans. Shout out my little bro, Beat Ups. Shout out to Wonder Women, though, for throwing a dope event. Shout out to all the women right now doing their thing. Shout out to Crump.
Shasta B-Dub, Shasta B-Dub, Squawk. J-Squad.